79-year-old Susie Mitchell is living with the early symptoms of Alzheimer's disease with help from a drug called Lakembi. I can stay active and healthy and with it. A few months ago, with the diagnosis of mild cognitive decline, she started receiving infusions. Her husband, Tom, says her symptoms have stayed the same, which to them is a real victory. I don't think there's been any change between even the first of the year and now. In January, the FDA fast-tracked the approval of Lakembi, which targets plaques in the brain associated with Alzheimer's. A clinical trial with 1,800 participants tested the drug against a placebo and found it can slow cognitive decline by 27 percent, effectively delaying the disease by about five months. But more than one in 10 users had brain swelling or bleeding, and three patients died. Without insurance, Lakembi costs more than $26,000 a year, but full FDA approval could expand coverage, including for up to a million Medicare patients with early cases of Alzheimer's. We do know that there are a lot of third party payers who are now having to strongly consider how they're going to pay and provide access to this particular drug. Mitchell hopes more patients like her can receive the medication. I feel like I can keep up and live my life the way I want to live my life. Grateful for a treatment that gives her time and hope. Bradley Blackburn, CBS News, New York.